Hello everybody and welcome to W3 Hill Wrestling Show and here in the W3 Hill Network. I am Stevie Wizard. Thank you once again for joining us. What promises to be a momentous week. I'm sure you've hit subscribe, right? So if you haven't, if ever there was a week to do it, it's this very week. Because just like I promised you seven days ago, we have that fantastic tag team title tables match coming up for you in just a moment. Now I'm sure you don't need me to tell you the history of uh, Mike Musso and Nathan Reynolds against the contingency plan. You've seen Musso go through a table. You've seen Taylor Bryan go through a table. Finally, management have decided that the belts will be on the line in this tables contest. Yeah. But they're not known as a contingency plan for nothing. Where Dickie Divers goes, Taylor Bryan is usually there. But for some reason, he's not this week. Now, I don't know where he is. Nobody seems to. But instead, they've pulled a fast one and brought in the returning James Scott. If you know your WTL history, you know he's a former tag champ, a former heavyweight champion as well. And the contract just said contingency plan. And as he's now seemingly a member of the group, he was able to step in. So it's going to be James Scott and Dickie Divers taking on Mike Musso and Nathan Reynolds for the Tag Team Championship. Um, I should point out before we go to this match, sadly Joe Fordays can't join us this week. And um, he has some families used to deal with. I'm sure he'll be back very soon. But don't let that detract from your enjoyment. Let's find out what happens as the tag team champions of Musso and Reynolds meet the contingency plan in this tag team title tables match.
What do you think you're doing?
Tag Team Tables match and new W3L Tag Team Champions, The Contingency Plan. Ladies and gentlemen, there you have it. We have brand new tag team champions in the form of Dickie Divers and James Scott. Quite what this means for the contingency plan and Taylor Bryden, I'm not actually sure. Does this mean that all three of them can defend the belts? Will it just be Divers and Scott now? I guess we'll find out as the weeks go on. Now ladies and gentlemen, I mentioned before about subscribing. I'm sure you have, but if you haven't, make sure you do, because we've got some big things happening here on Wrestling Show that in the coming weeks. On the first week in December, we've got possibly our biggest edition of Wrestling Showdown of all time. We will see three, yeah that's right, three championships being defended. Women's champion Leah Owens will face Carmel Jacob in that big Resolution 9 rematch. I'm sure you do not want to miss. The contingency plan, whichever pair of them is going to end up being, will defend the Tag Team Championships against Kevin Williams and a partner of his choosing. And then, in what is very possibly the biggest W3L heavyweight title defence in recent memory, perhaps of all time, the heavyweight champion, the one to watch Nathan Reynolds, will put that very prestigious belt on line against not one, not two, but three opponents in a four-way contest. Who are those opponents? They will be former champion Mike Musso, former champion James Scott, who now seems to be allied with the contingency plan, and a man who made a heck of an impact earlier and has returned, Joe E. Legend. If ever you didn't want to miss an episode of the show, do it's that one. First week in December, subscribe now so that you do not miss out. It is going to be monumental. For more information on that episode, for more information on WC as a whole, make sure you visit our website. WTLWrestling.com. You can of course find us on Facebook, it's facebook.com slash WTLWrestling, and we're on Twitter at WTLWrestling. Tell everybody about WTL. Use the hashtag WTLWrestling Showdown. Let everyone know you're going to be watching the first week in December. You're going to be watching every single episode and make your plans. And join us back here in seven days' time for even more Wrestling Showdown.